Welcome to Kinzai Band Camp. Today we're working on the legs. The legs are one of the harder muscle groups to access with resistance bands, but there's still a lot of options for you. Let's say, for example, I want to do a squat. If you're exercising, a simple naked squat will lose its effectiveness pretty quickly. There's just not enough weight to stimulate these extremely large quad and hamstring muscles. Also, you might not want to have a huge barbell around, which is what most people use to add that resistance. This little band can do a lot. We take it, stand here, get ready for our squat, and we just squat ooh, against that resistance. Extremely effective. Because as I stand up, it gets harder and harder and harder due to the elastic power of the band. You can do that same trick with a lunge. A regular lunge, it's okay, but if you want to add a little more challenge to it, slap a band under this front foot, draw the hands back, and now I'm lunging against that resistance every rep. Really effective. This one burns so hot on the quadriceps there. Whew, that's spicy. All right, what else can we do? A lot of people have trouble hitting the outer line of the legs here. With the resistance band, all you have to do is take a sit, hold the band doubled up, and open the legs against that. And I can feel my uh, gluteus minimus, as well as this IT band kicking into action to flare the knees open. And if you want to add more power, just choke up on the band and go deeper. This is really hard. It looks like not much of an exercise, but whew, I will feel that tomorrow. Abductor stretch. Finally, having a resistance band opens up a lot of interesting possibilities for all these small ancillary muscles of the groin and the upper leg by using it like an ankle attachment. I'm gonna take one end of the band and put the handle through the loop. This gives me a loop. So I'm gonna make that action around a post or something. Now I've got one end around the post. I'm gonna do the same thing on this end, creating a loop for my foot. My foot goes in there. And now we have a brand new piece of exercise equipment. From here, there's so many options. I can kick the leg back against that resistance. That's working my glute. I could turn and work the side here, which is hitting my groin and IT band. And I can turn away from the anchor and kick forward, which is hitting my quads. You have a ton of options once you have some resistance against the ankle. Now you can buy a ankle strap and it'll work a little better than this, but in the pinch, I've used this many times in hotels around the world when I need a quick leg exercise with just a band. So that's it, enjoy stimulating your legs with the power of resistance bands.